Welcome! Welcome to Soul Seekers' very first podcast. It may be a bit of a shit show, but we're going to give it a shot. We are here for it. So we are actually sitting in Aries' room right now. Um, There's a reason why we're coming from her room. So Tanya, would you care to share why we're in Aries' room right now? Well, besides the idea that you have this brilliant idea (laughs) driving here. (laughs) Well, besides that idea. I love that you don't... um, you just go with, I, I get random thoughts and ideas and Tanya's like, yeah, it's like that best friend that says, hey, um, I got a shovel, come with me, we're going to do this. And it's like, okay. I'll bring the lawn. Um, right? I'll bring the lawn. <laughs> <laughs> right? It's like, there's no, she doesn't question. She just goes with it. I have these ideas and she rolls with it. And they're usually pretty good. So <laughs> this, this is one of them actually. So, um... This house that I live in, that we've been here for about two years, um, kind of haunted. <laughs> kind of. Kind of. Yeah, it's, just, it's just a little bit haunted. Um, mostly in Aries' room. So that's why we're in here, because uh, there's been a lot of things happen here to every single one of us. Yes, yeah, so the idea that I had was because we wanted to podcast and share stories uh, because we are paranormal investigators we love to you know play around (laughs) in spirit world and we have a lot of stories and so we wanted to share them with you guys but the idea that I had today I thought well wouldn't it be cool if we were in the location where we're sharing stories from and then what if something happened while we were sharing stories just in the off chance we don't know it's an experiment but Aries room, things happen when she's here. I've seen things happen here. Like Kaylee's seen, we've all seen things happen in Aries room and we will get into that shortly and actually describe things that we've seen and heard. But the experiment is, while we're talking about it, maybe we can capture something, right? So I brought all my ghost tools. We have all kinds of stuff. We're gonna set things up. We're gonna try a bunch of things to communicate and see if we can get things going in the background and just you never know who might come through while we're here so we're coming we're coming to you live in a haunted bedroom (laughs) and whenever um tanya and amy say hey do you want to go ghost hunting i say yes absolutely i do no questions asked no questions asked it's like the shovel situation yeah that kind of friend (laughs) grab the shovel no questions (laughs) yeah so yeah this this room, I have to say, so when I first came into the house, um, checked out every room, and every room is very light, um, really positive energy, and as soon as I came into this room, I felt, actually, actually, right in this corner, right where we're sitting right now, is where, when I walked in this room, I was felt a spin, and I was like, ooh, we're gonna have to clear this room. So, you know, I didn't necessarily, it wasn't anything bad per se, but I definitely felt like there was some residual stuff here. Okay, wait. So basically, when last year when we moved in here, um, we bought the house over the internet. So we've never actually physically been in the house. And when we got here, we went around the house and this room was the only room that fell off. Like the rest had really good energy, but actually right where you're standing, when we came up here the first time, it was like I went here and I could feel the spinning. Like you get a certain sensation when you can feel spirit and it was in here. So yeah. So what's been happening to Ari, you know, well, we did the now? ghost box. Yeah. We did the ghost box shortly after we moved in. Yeah. And there was quite a few voices that came through. There was a little girl that was kind of eerie. It sounded like eerie. Like her voice sounded like her. Came through the box. And there was an older man. He told us to go to go down to go downstairs on the chair. He said the chair. Do you remember that? 
Yeah, so there's been some stuff coming up, but we just haven't, Mary hasn't felt comfortable us. So what has been happening in her room? Like, her friends have any experiences? Does she have any experiences, like, on the daily living in here? Like, what are some things that happen in here? Okay, what happened last week? The door slammed, or do you remember? You got really freaked out. Oh, yeah, I was, like, opening the door, and then the door just kind of, like, shut by itself, but, like, slammed. Amy, you're <laughs> <laughs> But you were doing something in here and you, I heard you screaming. What happened? Just the door shut? No, there was something else that happened. Yeah, there was something else, but I literally forget. There's so much shit that And then your friend slept over and said they saw someone coming out of the bathroom, like an old man or something, like a sh- in the bathroom. Yeah, so her something. friends have said that they feel stuff in here because they're, kind of, they're pretty open. And it's really a lot in the bathroom. Mm-hmm. And the cat ball just went off after I had placed it still. Okay, that's interesting. All right. Thank um, you for thank that. You for that. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, I was laying in Aries' bed, and I was, I, I literally, her room lit up this crazy orange color. It just went like a flash. It went, whew, it like flashed. It like, wasn't like a ball of light. It was not it was a flash. It of was light. the lo- room lit up like, psh, like it lit up. Like, like it lit the whole it room lit up. the whole room up wow it, it lit it up and it came from a you could see it came from the corner though it was like this bright intense light that came from the corner and just flashed like this corner or back corner the back corner that corner because wow. when i was sitting over there when mm-hmm. we were just kind of playing around mm-hmm. i saw an orange flash light in the bathroom that's interesting so it was an orange flash yeah. it was orange Cat ball's going off again. The cat ball's going off yeah, again. The cat ball's going off again. Okay. It's like the cat ball. Right. The cat ball's my favorite thing because it's... That's going off. <laughs> the girls? girls are like... Yeah. What's <laughs> happening? So, because yeah. it won't... No, if you're not touching it, it's not going to do anything, right? So there's obviously it's, something around it. Wow. Okay. Okay. So, well, I'm talking about the flash and it's like yeah. oh, yeah. almost confirmation, like, yes. So I had that ball in the corner, right? Because I wanted to like put it there to see if it lit up. We'd know something's there. Anyway, the flash of orange light goes off. And I'm like, Jill, did you see that? And she uh, said, uh, and the candle the just candle went off. The candle just went off. <laughs> Holy <laughs> man. Because I want to see if there's something actually there. So I have a NEM pod. This is called a NEM master from Paraforce. NEM master. NEM master. So the NEM <laughs> oh, pod. Oh, I'm the NEM master. I'm <laughs> the NEM master. <laughs> the NEM master. Are you Sorry. done? <laughs> wait, wait. Yep. Yeah, no, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> okay, now I'm done. So the NEM master only will read static electricity. Candle, ball, NEM yeah. it could, Candle, and it, like, That's another thing. Well, yeah. we could play with that. We yeah. could definitely play with that, too, and yes. see what happens. Oh, mm-hmm. okay. Mm-hmm. The NEM pod mm-hmm. just went off. Okay. As we it, were talking about it going off. Right. <laughs> okay. And it's on the shelf. It's over there with other things. Everything's kind of silent. So it's probably, if there's somebody here that... You can play with that if you if you want to play with that. It will if you go by it, try to touch it. Feel free to touch it and see what happens. Just touch it. Just touch go it. ahead and touch it. <laughs> just the tip. Just do it. Just the tip. Just the tip. <laughs> it's okay. We will <laughs> just do it. <laughs> just let it happen. <laughs> okay, so Feel free to touch the, any of those items right now. Just any of them. Just <laughs> touch, just touch any everything. Of, any of the items. Just touch it. Touch it. <laughs> touch, touch it real, real good. good. <laughs> <laughs> it's an LED candle, but there's only one setting. It's a white candle. It's white, and oh, it just it just, it just went off. So it, it, whenever there's a spirit around, it turns red. <laughs> but there's no red setting. So cool. I would love to hear from Ari, but she doesn't really want to talk to us right now. She's just so kindly letting us in her room. Yeah. <laughs> but um, she's really off. stoked about it. She's so excited. But lot, like <laughs> Ari was in the shower the other day. Do you want to share the shower story? Or are you good? Okay, she's good. She's shy, so we're going to share it for her. Right. Tanya, you share it because okay. you actually were here. So, <laughs> this was just like last week. Um, I'm in the living room. Ari texts me on Messenger to come to the bathroom immediately. So, I did, thinking something 
you know, I didn't know what, what that she's never done that before. So I, I wasn't sure what was going on. Anyway, I go in there. She says, mom, were you in here whistling? I'm like, no, I was sitting on the couch. <laughs> I wasn't in here whistling. She said something was in here whistling and then hit the shower curtain. <laughs> And it really scared her, actually. She she was pretty freaked out. So that's just like a normal Tuesday at my house. It's just a normal <laughs> Tuesday. So, Tuesday. Tanya, <laughs> since you're here, it's your house, yeah. what are some other things that Aries said happens in her room? Well, I've, I've witnessed things, too. So this was last summer, actually. Um, the way our house set is set up, the bedrooms are upstairs, and then there's the stairway and then the main floor. So I was... I had just talked to Ari and she was in her bedroom and then I was like, okay, I'll talk to you later. And then I started to go down the stairs and she was standing inside her bedroom and I was standing outside her bedroom about to go down the stairs and the door slammed in between us, both of us. And neither of us were near the door. Whoa. So that was kind of scary. Whoa. <laughs> so stuff like that will happen here. Um, That's crazy. Yeah. And it's usually like her closet. Tears in the closet. <laughs> so is your earphone set up? She, she can't even answer me. Huh? You can't even hear me. Perfect. I cannot hear you. That's perfect. <laughs> As proof that she cannot hear me. So she's going in. Okay, are you, is your EVP going? Uh, candles back on. Candles back on. EVP going? EVP is going. Okay, and you're sweeping? And my video is on. And your ch channels are sweeping? Channels are sweeping. Okay, in you go. So. I just need to turn the volume up a little. Okay, so her camera's going. All right, so her camera's going. She cannot hear us. So we are going to talk to the spirit that's in this room. Yep. So I, I have sensed two spirits, actually. Um, an older male who he's quite timid, and he's nice. Like, I get a good feeling off of him, and then I get a... Breathe. Breathe. Okay. And then I get a, um, a kind of teenager... A girl who's not as friendly. Not that she's like negative or demonic. Touch. Right? Touch. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that's what I. That's what I usually sense in here. So we should ask some questions. Dance. Dance. Um. Are we talking to Unique. the female spirit right now? Are we talking to male or female? Yeah. Who are we talking to right now? Can you please talk through Tara's, Tara's earphones? She has earphones on, she's in the closet. Can you talk to her in there? Or touch her. Ooh, give her a touch. Oh, the candle's back on again. Okay. Tara, like pull her hair. Oh no. <laughs> like pull her hair. <laughs> she loves that. If she could, says, you tell, could you tell us your name? Dawn. Not. Dawn is your name. Did you say gone? Oh, gone or Dawn? Gone. No. Gone? I thought or was it just said Dawn? Dawn. We'll have to rewind the footage, okay. but it's either Gone or Dawn. Yeah. If it was Dawn, that's crazy. That'd be cool. Could you please say your name again? We didn't quite make that. Is it Dawn? I heard Dawn. Well, I am hard of hearing, so it could have been Dawn. Okay. We'll have to review that. Yeah. So we'll definitely have to review that one. So we have, the, is the lights on? Oh, it went off. Yeah. Is your name Dawn? Is that what you said?
That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Oh. Do you not want to talk to us? We live here with you. I'd like to know who was the one in, in the shower with Ari the other day. Because that's a little bit off of bounds, quite honestly. What are you laughing at over there? <laughs> and you? Were you in the shower with Ari the other day? <laughs> Were you whistling? Were you whistling? Yes. Oh, what? <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Yes, it was you. Okay. Okay. That's so, great. can you tell me your name? This is Dawn we're talking to. It could be Dawn, D-O-N, like a male. Stupid. Right. Well, that okay. was pretty. That was a little rude. Okay, so are we talking to the young girl or the older male? I feel like the whistling thing would be a man thing. Like, I don't feel... I don't know. That's just me. Yeah. It feels like old man. Oncoming. Oncoming? You, you. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> look fit. Look fit. <laughs> you look good. Oh, oh dude. <laughs> So, I don't know. In account? Okay. Okay. So, wow. <laughs> I don't even know what to say, lad. Radio? Yeah. Oh. We'll check the radio. Yeah. That might be, they might think it's that, or they might think that's a radio. Yeah. All right. Okay. A spirit that was in the shower with Aries. Very... Unforgettable, apparently. Wow. Oh, my God. has a crush on my daughter. Touch it. <laughs> what is happening? Okay, this stay? is. This is stay scary. or stay? I can't even. Like, this is turning this into is, an X rated. This is, <laughs> this is a, whoa. This is on some different website. This, <laughs> this, is, this is some OnlyFans shit, right? This, <laughs> OnlyFans podcast. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. No, that's what you creepy. Oh, wow. I'm. You're done. That's a lot. That's a lot to process. Um, can we have someone else come through? That was like a. That's a pervert ghost. Yeah, he's a perv. Well, he was literally whistling, watching you in the yeah. showers. So. <laughs> Innocent. My heart. Oh no, he's hurt. He's hurt. My heart. Maybe he loves her. Do you have a crush on Aerie? Oh, Aerie. Do you love? Do you really like Aerie? Maybe he's like jealous. Scam. Spam. Scam. 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 Do you like Aerie? <laughs> wow. I just don't even. This is a. Say. This is a lot right now. <laughs> I don't even know how to process this. What do you think I feel like? It's yeah. a pervert ghost that's been checking out my daughter. I don't... Okay, so we already asked how many spirits are in here. Um, so if you can give us a number. Relax. Okay. You telling us to relax? I'm probably when you're screaming. Calm down. Bishop. Are we playing chess now? <laughs> We're playing chess. Okay, should, so okay. can you give us a name or maybe how old you are? Did you live in this house before? I have so many questions for you. 
good questions. Are you guys calling my name? No. no. Are you hearing your name? It's like not through, not through the headphones. Uh, no. Like, okay. You hear your name? It sounded like a deep, low, um, like, like I could hear it off in the distance and it sounded like you guys. Uh, no. Okay. That's interesting. Do you want it? Does anyone want to switch off there? Does anyone else want to go in the closet? Is there anyone else that wants to communicate through anything? Help to focus. Is there any help to people? Well, you need to come through one and reply. Because Ariona? But it came out like Arione, but I'm assuming it meant Ariona, but it was like Arione. Okay, Ari, Ari wants to sh Don't go. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Like, she's kind of like Ariana. She's like getting freaked out. Is she? Down, yeah. Okay. 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 Hello, or should we say good morning? Good morning. So this is actually the day after. We are kind of what you call spirit drunk or hungover. spirit hungover. That's true. After an eventful evening yep. in Aries room. So our experiment actually went well. Very well. Very well. Yes, it went very well. So we, you know, went in with the intention that we were going to just, you know, talk about Aries room and hoping that something would happen in there. And well, it did, which was very exciting. But the reason why we want to come on today, this morning, is just to kind of give a little disclaimer to let you know that one, um, in case any of you guys were worried about Ari listening to last night, she was shy, and but she did express that she wanted to stop what we were doing. She got a little freaked out, um, yeah, which is after, okay. After. You said. I didn't say it. Well, the spirit <laughs> said Ariona. Ariana. So that was her, her limit. Yeah, so when the when the spirit actually said her name, it, that kind of was it for her. But we just want to let you guys know that Ari um, has lived in haunted houses her whole life. So this is not her first paranormal encounter. She has dealt this with- This is tame. <laughs> this house is tame compared to our other house that she literally grew up in. So this is, this is nothing. It's nothing. So don't you worry. <laughs> yeah, so she's fine. Um, we actually cleared her room and we did like an incantation and smoke. some smoke. We cleared her room and she actually said she had the best sleep overnight <laughs> of her life. Yeah, yeah. So, she had a good sleep. So her and her friends. So they are good. No worries. Yeah, so don't be worried. She's fine. We're all fine. We all slept well. So we just kind of wanted to uh, give a little disclaimer to let you know that Aerie is fine. And um, we were reviewing, well, Tara was reviewing some of the footage from last night. And she messaged us today to kind of put some things together. She said, did you realize that when you guys were owed in the room saying, touch her, touch her, like, yeah. you know, go pull her hair and touch her. There was a point where she actually, what came through the earphones for her, she said being touched or touching or yeah. something about that. So we didn't put that together, actually. I don't know why we didn't put that together in the moment. Sometimes you miss things in the moment. When you review the footage is when a lot of yeah. really cool pieces of the puzzle kind of kind of connect yeah yeah and so she kind of put that together and that was kind of neat yeah and then did you you had something else too oh just uh we were talking this morning amy and i about the the voices like so how when tara was in the closet with the headphones she thought that she heard 
us talk, calling her name, wasn't it? Right. Like not in the headphones, but like outside in the room. And then when Amy was in there, you heard Tara's voice. So there's definitely something to that. Yeah, I heard her voice actually coming through the spirit box. Yeah. It was crazy because I can't, it was literally her voice. It was, I couldn't, com I couldn't decipher what she was saying, but I was like, that was Tara's voice. That is yeah. weird. Yeah. yeah. So there's definitely something there. And everyone had like, well, Ariana's name came through the spirit box and Kaylee's, Kaylee's had her name yeah. actually said to her, like in her ear, like Kaylee. So there's something about that. They, they like to say the names, like they yeah. actually are bringing forward, you know, people's names in there. So there's yeah. more to it. We're going to explore her, her room some more. The, we'll be back. We'll be back for sure. <laughs> and we're actually in future episodes. We are going to talk about Tanya's house because this house is crazy. The yeah. story of how she even came here is crazy into this house. All the things we have so much more yeah. that we want to share with you. So, uh, we just want to thank you so much for tuning into this episode today. It was a, I think it was a really fun experiment and I think we're going to do more. Yeah. Like, uh, drop a comment. If you think that going live, doing the podcast in a, haunted location was cool or not because I think it was pretty awesome. Peace out. <laughs> Peace out, motherfuckers! <laughs> I'm doing sexy! Oh. Bye-bye. Take care of yourselves. <laughs> Take care of yourselves. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Until next time. Until next time. Bye. Bye.